Welcome again to our English listening, our YouTube channel, 3A3B3C. How is it going? I hope you are well. And I want to say also welcome to our dear parents. So now it's June. Now it's summertime. It's very hot outside, as you see. I'm also wearing t-shirt because I cannot wear shirts and tie and jacket. So when the weather is very hot, because it's summertime. I love summertime. And today uh, our topic is uh, our future plan. As you know that uh, we have talked with you about the future tense, future simple tense in our previous video. And uh, also I said a few sentences about future plan. So future plan uh, should be consisted from future simple tense. For example, I can say about my future plan for this, for this day. After taking a video, I will go to gym. It's my plan for a future. Then, after gym, I will come back to home. And then, in evening, I will eat pasta, for example. So, it's like an example. I don't know what will happen after five minutes. So, it, it's like an example. Uh, also, you can say about your future plan, about uh, your uh, plan for, uh, you know, for the uh, nearest future. I know that now it's summer, you don't have any plans. Summertime is a very great time to have fun, to relax and uh, to activities. So, about this one you can say, for example, yeah, uh, in this summer I will uh, go Antalya or I will go Izmir. So, I will see my friends, we will have fun, we will swim in the sea, and we will drink cold juice. So, it's a, it's a, a plan for a future summer, for this summer, because now it's June. Yeah, that's it. Now it's June and it's very hot outside, and you must have a plan for this future summer, for this summer. So, I think that you and your parents have already done the plan and they, you will follow this plan as well. Alright, it's about the summer. Let's uh, think global. Let's think global. About, uh, after summer. After summer, I know we will meet. We will see each other after summer in September. You will come to school. It's in, uh, you will come to school in September. So, and we have uh, little rules uh, in our new life. You know that now we have a new life and uh, uh, we won't have same life which we had, uh, for example, three months ago. You will wear masks. Yeah, you will wash your hands every lesson, before lesson and after lesson. You will sit separate. You won't sit with your friends together. You will have separate table and it will be just your place. Look, do you follow my speech? I use everywhere will. For example, I said you will have uh, your individual place, you will have separate place, you will have your individual table and you will not, you won't sit with your friends. All right, it's uh, during our lessons. It will be, it will be during our lessons. What about the eating? What about the canteen? You will eat separate, okay? You won't sit with your friend also in canteen. You will eat just in your place. You will have a distance one and a half or two meters from each other in September, from September. Okay? You will mm, wash your hands so with the antiseptic before lesson and after lesson. You will take care about your health and we will help you with this uh, stuff, 
that's it. As you see, I used everywhere wheel because we are talking about the future plan and this plan is uh, for September. I mean, we will start, we will start it from, from September because uh, from, from September you will have uh, you will have lessons and these lessons won't be same lessons as you had before in March or in February. In February, as you remember, okay, let's speak about the past tense also. In February, as you remember, we, uh, we had lessons and you sat next to each other, you could run and you could come to your friends and you could have a fun. Unfortunately, in September, you won't have it. As I said, you will have your individual table, okay, and uh, it will be just table just for you, just you can use it, and your table will be protected by the glass, table and glass, no one can touch you and no one can sit next for you because it's a glass, you will be in the glass, all of you, if for example there are 20 students in the class, 20 tables with a glass. So, it's an individual way for protection. That's why you should take care about yourself. And uh, we are trying to do it. In September, you will have a new way of lessons. It's a plan for future. Education plan. All right, we talked about the summer plan. So, we talked about education plan. So let's speak about our social activity, okay, about, about our social activity. As you know, uh, we have very different time now. We, uh, we cannot, for example, go outside without masks. Sometimes we are wearing gloves in markets. Unfortunately, children, I mean, you, 3A, 3B, 3C, you cannot enter to uh, AVMs or, uh, for example, uh, or markets or uh, malls, so you cannot enter somewhere and uh, yeah, it's a little bit disgusting, yeah, I know, but it's uh, our modern life for now. So, that's why uh, we can say about also our social life. You won't enter to mall. So, there are many malls in Istanbul, but these are not for children now. You want enter to markets, to some shops, for example, to de facto or to Waikiki, something like this one, okay? You won't enter, unfortunately. It's uh, interrogative sentences. I, I'm giving for you interrogative sentences. All right, uh, you uh, won't uh, go outside without masks. You must wear masks. And then you can go outside. If you want to go outside, you must wear masks. And in the future, it's like, it's not a plan, unfortunately. It's uh, real, realistic. So, uh, you must wear masks and go out. If you want to go out, you will wear mask. Yeah, it doesn't matter how old you are. You are 8 or you are 18. It doesn't matter. Alright, it's about our uh, social... It's not a plan, it's social life. We have it in our days, unfortunately. We have it nowadays and we should follow these rules. It's just for us, for our health. So, okay, it's about our future plan. And uh, let's speak about your future life, your future plan. You know, and uh, we know it's normal. You will graduate, you will finish the, the school and you will study in university. Okay, you will be or engineer, you will be or doctor, you will be uh, maybe teacher, who knows, who knows uh, what you will be in the future, who knows. So, but uh, all of you will have your own job, your own profession. It's also like a plan. So, before, uh, before going to the university, okay, your parents will speak with you, okay. Kuzey or okay, Derin, what uh, what want to you what uh, what will you wanna be in the future? What want to you to do? Okay, so and then you can answer that I want to be, for example, an engineer. So and then you will uh, enter to uh, some 
uh, university uh, with the engineering department, something like this one. I mean, if you want to be a doctor, you will use and you will choose that branch which uh, is according for a doctor's job. Okay, if you want to be a teacher, you will use that branch which is according to the teacher's job. So, you will use that branch uh, which you want. So, it's a plan for your future job. So, first of all, your parents, as I said, will ask you, what do you want to be in the future? What kinds of job do you want to choose? And your answer will be, I want to be, I don't know, maybe pilot, maybe driver, maybe teacher, maybe, who knows, maybe engineer or doctor. There are many jobs, there are many professions and, you know, actually we talked about it with you. So, uh, that's why uh, you will choose just one job for yourself. I choose the mine job, as you know, I am a teacher of English and I am working with you and I did it in past. So, that's why I won't have another job in the future. I am a teacher now and I will be also a teacher because I choose my job. Why I told about it to you? Because you should think about it. You should think about it very deeply because you won't have another chance. You will have just one chance and the one opportunity for choose your future job. All right, it was about the future plan. So, and as you know, as you see, as you watched, as you heard, I uh, used everywhere future form, will and want. Will, it's in uh, normal sentences, affirmative sen sentences, and uh, want uh, is in uh, negative, interrogative sentences. So that's why you can do it as well. All right, today is our, I think, that last YouTube lesson. And uh, that's why, I don't know, I cannot say goodbye, I cannot say take care, because I always repeat these words in my uh, video lessons for you. So that's why I just want to, uh, I just want to have a short sentence for you. Our dear children, 3A, 3B, 3C, take care. Just take care. And have a fun! in this summertime. I promise we will see each other in September. Love you too much. Bye-bye.